all your life you've seen thousands and thousands of photos of places. But out of all those photos, I bet there's one thing you've never said about any of them. It's like being there. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you again. So today we're going to talk about the Views XR, a new 360 camera that converts into a VR 180 camera as well. We're going to talk about the advantages of a VR 180 format and why you might want a camera that can convert from VR 180 to 360. We'll also talk about its detailed specifications. We'll take a look at its other features and we'll take a look at some samples. Hi, my name is Mick and you're watching 360 Rumors, the resource that 360 shooters trust for in-depth camera reviews and innovative techniques. When I was a kid, my parents had this giant um, photo wallpaper mural in their room and it was a scene of a forest and I guess if I stood like a few feet from the wall it would completely fill my field of vision but even then I wouldn't say that it felt like being there in the forest and that's kind of how it is with regular photos isn't it no matter how detailed I can't really say that it feels like being there now what about 360 photos well they're definitely more immersive but looking at a 360 photo with a VR headset is like being in the inside of a ball. So if you entered a room where all four walls were covered with this photo wallpaper, and in fact even the ceiling and the floor were also covered with it, then how would that feel? For many people, that's still not sufficiently immersive, and you still don't get the feeling of like being there. Well, how can we make that more immersive? The answer is with stereoscopic VR, with 3D 360 photos and videos. You'll be able to see a photo that's not just flat, but has depth on all sides. So it truly gives you this feeling of being there. But 3D 360 videos can be challenging to direct. So for example, the audience might feel lost and not know where to look. There's actually a video by YouTube creators where they talk about uh, techniques for directing a 3 c video. You can check it out in the description below. Is it possible to get the immersiveness of 3D 360 in a more accessible format? A format that's easier to use. And that's the premise for this new VR 180 format. So VR180 is this new immersive VR format where it's stereoscopic but only in the front hemisphere. So this has several advantages. For example, your audience won't feel lost. They'll know where to look. And if you're a director and you, you can put your lighting and equipment and yourself, you could stay behind the camera and you don't need to worry about being seen. So it has several practical advantages. On the other hand, VR 180 does have its own weaknesses. For example, the stabilization is not good. 360 has unparalleled potential for stabilization because you can use the whole sphere to rotate the image to make it level. And that brings us to the Views XR, which is both a VR 180 and a 360 camera with stabilization. Let's talk about the specifications of the Views XR. It has two sensors that are 1 over 2.3 inch Sony IMX377 BSI CMOS sensors. With the BSI CMOS design, the circuits are behind the photodiodes to allow them to receive more light for better light sensitivity in low light situations. Typically, BSI CMOS sensors have around one third to two thirds stops advantage over their uh, non-BSI or front illuminated counterparts. There's two fisheye lenses that, are, that each have 210 degrees field of view. The video resolution is 5.7K at 30fps or 4K at 60fps. The photo resolution is 18 megapixels. It can also live stream and it has in-camera stitching at 4K. Yes, it has stabilization and yes, it has an optional waterproof case. I had a chance to talk to Jim Malcolm, who's the GM for North America for Humanize, 
and I got to ask him some questions about the Views XR. So here are the takeaways from my discussion with Jim. First of all, yes, the Views XR is 5.7K and that means it is more detailed or can be more detailed than the Views uh, 3D360 camera. Second, yes, it does have stabilization and yes, the stabilization is gyro based, not just uh, purely software based. And you'll be able to get stabilized videos, not just on the desktop, but also on the mobile app. Speaking of the mobile app, it has several features that include uh, being able to adjust the image, being able to add stamps, and more critically, they have this feature they call director mode, which is kind of like over capture. So you'll be able to take a 3D video and choose the view that you want to show to your viewers. With the director mode, you'll be able to create cinematic moves and you'll be able to integrate your 3D videos with videos from your DSLR or your smartphone. Now, all these features are great, but how does the Views XR look in terms of its video quality? Well, let's take a look. Yeah, it looks pretty good, quite detailed. More detailed than I expected. And uh, I like the stereoscopic effect. It's, uh, it feels, looks very realistic. So you should check it out. There's a link in the description below. Um, before we talk about price and availability, let's talk about some of the other alternatives because the V6R is not the only 360 camera that converts to a VR180 camera. There's also the Candel Kucam, check out my video, and the upcoming uh, Kodak PixPro uh, VR180 slash 360 camera. The Views XR differs from them in that the Views XR has a 5.7K resolution, uh, whereas the Candel Kucam is 4K and the Kodak, to my knowledge, is also 4K. But in the end, what really matters is how they actually look. And so I will be reviewing them and comparing them um, as soon as possible. So be sure to subscribe so you can see the full review and comparison of the Views XR and these other cameras. Also check out my page about the Views XR which has detailed information and I'm going to keep it updated with more information as it becomes available. So meanwhile, the Views XR is available for pre-order right now uh, directly from Humanize. The website is uh, viewsxr.com. The price will be $439 for delivery in uh, late November. And I think the price is a pretty good deal considering it's a 5.7K camera and you have this dual functionality. And if you're gonna pre-order, there's a bonus. You will get a, a free waterproof case and you'll also get a free micro SD card and free global shipping. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in 360.